So there is another type of file um, that is that you can play and you have to do it a different way. So this is going to be method two using what's called the live scribe player which is on which is online. So let's say I wanted to play the narrated answer key here for November 18th practice problems. So when I click it I still have my same window. When I click that window it's still going to take me to Evernote and I'm still going to then download that file um, at least on a PC. Now when I open it you notice there's going to be something that's a little bit different here and that is on top it says download this PDF to your computer and then go to www.livescribe.com slash player and we're going to put that file into that online player and allow it to play the video. So when you're looking at the PDF file after it's downloaded if it says to use the Adobe Reader then you're going to go ahead and use method one the Adobe Reader if it says to use the LiveScribe player you're going to use that. LiveScribe is the pen and the um, system that I use to record these systems, uh, these, these videos or PDFs. They're basically animated PDFs. So I've downloaded the file into my downloads so let me go up here. It's going to be www.livescribe slash player. I don't know if I push that blue button if it would take me directly to that. Let's see. Well, it will. So now it says download your LiveScribe PDF and then drop it there. Or you can use the blue one to um, have a menu system. So let's if, if I'm in a system like this where it's already downloaded, I can grab it, bring it up here, and throw it in the player. And then now I'll see, now I'll have control over the player. It's a slightly different thing here is my play button. Um, I go from page to page this way. If I want to get rid of the writing, I can come over, uh, where is it in this stupid system? Uh, maybe it's not. Well, maybe when I start playing, the green will disappear. Okay, I'll turn okay here's an narrated answer key for the oh, you guess in, you in, in class problems uh, for oh, that we did in class uh, for I November 21st. Oh, wait, maybe it's up here. Okay, so in so the so problems that I'm going to have an area to answer so key for. Here, so I'm not talking over myself. If I come up here and I say display folks preview, it now completely dis it completely disappears. So now when I do the play, which is the first set where you're given a reaction, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. gonna get so is we're gonna get a 50-50 mixture of these two products. So now when it writes, and so these two products were uh, this was product A, this was product strokes. B, and so the correct answer is. Then we get a 50-50 mixture of products of A and B. So, stop. so if you wanted to go to the next problem, you could basically come down here, click on number two, and we'll start playing at number two. For product for number two. So it, it's a slightly different viewer. It is um, a website, but sometimes when I use the program, it would be, it would work well with Adobe and sometimes you needed this player. So what you have to do is look at the PDF file and see if it says player, then this is how you would play it. And this is what the player looks like. If you have like an iPad or an iOS system, you can actually download, probably still download the LiveScribe player. And then you could just download the file and then upload it into using that player. But um, I don't have Mac stuff, I don't, so I can't really show you how to do that. So this, so that's method two if it calls for using the LiveScribe player.